Hey guys, I welcome you on my channel Data Science AI with Aditya Vesh. So most of you are asking about how to do the installation of MySQL. So today I'm going to cover the latest version of MySQL. It is a step by step tutorial. So do not miss it. And if you miss it, then everything will go wrong and all the steps you have to do it again. So it's very important. So first of all, you have to go to your Chrome browser. There you have to write MySQL. And then after that, you have to click here on the downloads. Okay, when you click on the download, it will open a website there. Automatically, the download menu will be selected. Then you have to go down, scroll down, MySQL Community GPL Downloads. Click on that. And there, MySQL Installer for Windows. You have to click on that. Then here, you can see that uh, there are two files. So, down file, which is of 354.3 MB, you have to download that. Then here, no thanks, just start my download. So here on the top, it will be downloading. So let wait for it to download. Once it is downloaded, then we have to open that and start with the installation process. So here it has begun the installation process and whatever notification comes, then you have to allow it. Okay, we have to wait for the next window. So it's preparing yes so yes here we have to click on the custom because we want or either you can click on the full and directly install all the products or you can go with the custom and install the products you can select as per your choice so here as you can see we will select my sql server we can click before the plus and then after that again we have to click on the plus inside this and then again we will click plus inside this Then we will select our server here and, and using the green arrow, we will select this product to be product to be installed in this window. Same way we will be going for the applications. Here we will select MySQL Workbench application. So these steps are very important. So select it and then we will take it to the product to be installed then after that we can go with the shell installation or if you don't go then you can go with the documentation pair minimum is this much required for the working on the mysql then after that we will do next and we will start with the process of installing these product yes we will allow So here we will execute it and the installation will start for these particular products. So after this, we will configure our product once this installation of the product is completed. So yeah, it's done. We will go and click next. So in the product configuration, we will do next. And here, uh, here we don't have to do anything next. Everything will remain same here. After that, uh, first option, next. And here we have to enter a password. Make sure that you enter a simple password so that you do not forget it. Otherwise, if you forget it, then it will be a very long process. You have to repeat everything, uninstall and all. Okay, so now you have to click here on the next. Don't have to do anything here. Just click on the next again. Grant the full access, click on the next. Yes, wait here. We have to execute it so that it can apply the configurations. So, so yes, all the configurations are applied. It is successfully downloaded. We have to finish and then open it. Now, to open it, you have to go on your start. There, you have to write MySQL. Then it will open up. Here, you will see it will ask for the password. Click on it and then enter your password. If you want, you can save this password also, but do not save it because otherwise you may tend to forget it. So, just Enter your password, say OK. And when you click on OK, you will see that the window will come in front of you where you can execute your syntax. So here we are executing a simple syntax that is of creating a database that you can see it here. Let us create database and the name of the database. So guys, this is how we do the installation of MySQL step by step. So also I have begun a series, day to day series where you can learn your SQL 
in very simple steps. So I have begun a series. You can subscribe to the channel Data Science AI with Aditya Vesh and you can start your journey for SQL. Day-wise, new videos are coming there. Thank you guys. Take care and subscribe the channel.